Good afternoon, everyone. My name's Peter Brackley. This is a long-awaited friendly match. Palermo versus South East London. Now we've invited Trevor Brooking to provide us with match analysis today, so welcome to the game, Trevor. Yeah, thanks, Peter. It's a pleasure to be here. formation we're expecting the team to use so let's get going Let's see what kind of match these two teams can produce. Passes forward. Rolls it upfield. He takes it off to the side. Touches it back. Good goalkeeping. Sends it forward. Knocks it forward, pushes it upfield. The referee blows his whistle. It's a foul. Perfect ball in. Clear with a header. Plays it wide to the right. Slides it past the defence. No, it's been snuffed out. They continue to keep possession comfortably. Sends it to the left. No trouble for the keeper. We have reached the half hour mark. Knocks it upfield. Moves the ball towards the left flank. The flag's up. This is a replay of that particular incident. The idea was right, but the execution was lacking. That was close. That was an awful pass. Launches the ball forwards. Down the left flank. The right is cleared away. Sends a sweeping pass out to the right. Plays it into the centre. Plays it forward. There's the whistle for the end of the first half. Been a rather disappointing performance. For on them so far, hasn't it? You're right, Peter. They're a little too defensive at the moment. They've struggled to create chances, and they're going to have to do better in the second half. Let's see what effect the half-time break has on the teams. Will we see a goal in the second half? 
down the left channel. Looking for space down the left hand side. Still running. He cleared. Knocks it along the floor. A magnificent goal. In the first few minutes of the second half. That puts them in front. He's only just come back from half-time and already he has struck. It's taken a while, but there's the opener. A goal like that will always give your team a huge boost. They've taken the lead. How do you see the game developing from here on then, Trent? Well, from the fans' point of view, the goal's great news. Their opponents can no longer sit back and contend with things as they stand. And he dicks it through. The ball has rolled harmlessly for a goal kick. Maybe he struck it just a little bit too hard. So, a fresh pair of legs. Knocks it short. We're into the last 30 minutes of the game. Konczewski. He dribbles out to the left. Sends it into the middle. Can't they finish it off? No, it's clear. Will this free kick bring? Fine save. Fish. Di Canio. Barkley. We're almost in the final quarter of an hour. There was no way through that tight defence. And he's gone for it. He takes the ball along the left wing. Great cross. Too long and out of play. Rolls it forward. Rolls it to the right. Ryan Hughes. They seem happy to hold on to their advantage. Just five minutes to go. Booted to safety. Di Canio. I think he deserves a card for that incident. Yellow card. That's another look at that tackle. Well, that's the kind of thing referees have been told to clamp down on. Rolls it back. Fish. Now play switches to the left flank. Not much time left. Looking for some open space. And he's found. That's it. That's the final whistle. 1 0. They've scored the only goal of the game and snatched the win. The first half was a bit disappointing, but the game did come to life a bit, didn't it, in the second half? No, oh, definitely, Peter. The goal improved the quality of the game, but that first half did drag on a bit, didn't it?